Hello everybody, how are you? We're here in Reynoldsburg still enjoying the day. It was sunny and nice. Now it's slightly cloudy and still a nice temperature. It's in the 70s, it's not too hot. You get, you get a little bit of that Ohio humidity, but really overall a pleasant day. And you know, I posted a couple of videos about Reynoldsburg and right away I started getting the questions like, well, you posted things about Reynoldsburg, different things that are going on. Well, what if you want to date? What if you're in the in the mode where you're trying to find somebody to date? Maybe a boyfriend, maybe a girlfriend, maybe you're looking to get even more serious than that. Well, how do you find people? Well, guys, I know uh, specifically of five things to do in Reynoldsburg that lend themselves naturally to meeting people of the opposite sex or of the same sex, whatever you're looking for, these are ways, easy ways to meet people in a casual setting that's not a bar. And I know some people have meet, met their mate in a bar, but not everybody wants to meet somebody in a bar. So, number one on the list for Reynoldsburg is the Funky Mittens Club. Now, the Funky Mittens Club is for anybody that wants to meet people on a once-a-week meeting making funky mittens. Now, this is Ohio. Guys, you're going to need mittens. You're going to need gloves. And what better way to create your own mittens than knitting them yourself? Now, maybe you don't know how. Don't worry. At the Funky Mittens Club in Reynoldsburg, they're going to teach you how to do it, guys. And believe me, if you want to meet some cool people, they're all down there, and they're looking to meet you, you you catch. So number two on the list, we're just going to snap through them real quick. If you have any questions, shoot me a note, shoot me a message, shoot me a text, shoot, send your flying bird, your bird message to me. I'll make sure that I address it. Hey, we may even make a video about it. Number two on the list is the Soup Up My Camaro Club. Now, if you live in Reynoldsburg, you've seen more than one muscle car souped up, angled up, big fat tires. It's almost like it was 1972 again. And trust me, I was there. So if you are interested in cars, if you're interested in REO Speedwagon, Fog Hat, uh, Rush, any of those bands, then this might be the club for you. And it's colloquially, it has a colloquial title, soup up my Camaro club, but you don't have to have a Camaro. Could be a Firebird, could be a Trans Am, could be a Dodge Charger, whatever. But guys, they meet once a week. Now, it's true that it's mostly guys, but the thing about automotive um, maintenance, repair, improvement, and uh, gearheading is a lot of girls are getting into it. So girls, this if you're looking for a guy that's into cars, this is the club to you for you because you're going to meet a lot of guys. And it's a casual... See, that's the thing. That's the beauty of it, isn't it? It's a way to meet people in a casual setting that takes the pressure off because you're going to learn how to soup up your Camaro or other muscle cars right here in Reynoldsburg. And trust me, you see the members going up and down these roads all the time. You won't, be, you won't have your hearing anymore after they go by, but you'll know they're there. Number three uh, of, of the fun ways to meet people of the opposite sex or same sex, whatever you're interested in, in Reynoldsburg is a new one that they have uh, developed with the city. And what is going to happen is starting this fall, starting in September during the football season, it's called the football fall down. And what it is, it's a combination of, of a fall dance, those old school fall dances that they had, and the football season. So during football games of local games here in Reynoldsburg, every Friday night for the oldsters, and that means people that are 20 to 20, 20 to 40 uh, or older, uh, you can go to the football fall down. Now, the it's kind of corny, to be honest with you. Because during the football fall down, during the night, they have special dances that you can learn, line dances. So, you know, I've just came from somebody's wedding. What did they do? They did a line dance. So it's still hot. It's still happening. And then during this one particular line dance that is the highlight of the night, everybody falls, the line dance, it's a line dance, and then everybody falls like dominoes. And that's why they call it the football fall down. It's during the football season, and it's a fall down. So... It's more, I would say it's more for people that 
uh, are less serious, they want to have fun. Maybe it's a younger crowd, uh, but it could also be an older crowd. But if you're the type that goes to art galleries and you know wine wine bars, probably it's going to be a little too corny for you. But it's another option for those that are just young and young at heart. The football fall down starting this fall during football games after after the Reynoldsburg High School football games at a, a two to be determined location, and you're going to enjoy it. All right, that's number three. Number four, really, we talked about people that like uh, wine bars and art galleries as if that was some kind of highfalutin thing and that they might not like that other option. But uh, an art gallery actually is a good way to meet somebody that's interested in the intellectual pursuits, that likes history, that likes art, and that likes wine, perhaps. But... How do you meet those people? Well, you go to the Reynoldsburg Art Gallery Hop. And so the thing about it is you might want to get a group of people. This is a good way to do it. Get a group of people to go and get them to invite their friends. And that's a neat way to meet people is through your friends' friends. Now, be careful about selecting your friends because there's a good chance that their friends are like them. So if you choose the wrong friends, then the friends will be like their, those bad friends and then you'll end up with a bad date. But yeah, there's a number, there's 30 or 40 different art galleries sprinkled throughout Reynoldsburg. Everything from American art to French art to English, his, you know, uh, more, more of the Gothic art. There's Impressionism. And so they have a gallery hop every other day starting beginning uh, October 1st. The, uh, and then it'll run through the winter. So during the winter months, bring your mittens that you made at the Mittens Club, the fan fancy Mittens Club, because it's going to get cold. But again, it's packed. It's people love it. Uh, you might even consider joining one of the galleries if that's the art that you prefer, be it impressionism or whatever it is. And finally, the fifth one on our list is short track racing. Now, this is again a more of an automotive, uh, not more of. It is an automotive interest. It's short track racing, which is like racing you might see on TV. Uh, but in a small oval-like track that is uh, looks like a width of a length of a football field of a high school, okay? But it's bigger than that. But that's what it looks like when you're there. And so short track racing, you might if you're from Grove City, you know all about it. You grew up around it, okay? And it's new to the Reynoldsburg area. So to encourage people to come out to the Reynoldsburg Super Hot Short Track Racing Track they are having special singles nights so again that's a good way to meet people and uh, probably the the same tactic it would be good and that is to invite a bunch of people so maybe have a uh at your at your work okay have get get the tickets you see this is where dating it kind of takes a little bit of effort but anyway however you want to organize it get a bunch of people to go out to the reynoldsburg uh super hot short track short track racing and guys you're gonna love it now just be prepared. When they do the short track racing, it burns rubber dust, and the rubber dust gets in the air, and some will get in your beer. But uh, so you may not, if you didn't know that, you may drink some of that rubber dust. Uh, but don't worry, I've done it, and uh, honestly, it makes it makes anything you eat after that uh, super slippery and goes right into your gullet after that. So it's not enough to harm you, and actually helps helps food go down for the, at least the next week to man, week to 10 days. Uh, and then if you want that, if you want that feature, go back to the short track racing. But by then you're probably in a relationship with somebody you met there. Guys, those are five fun things to do right here in Reynoldsburg, Reynoldsburg, Ohio, and all America city. I'll talk to you soon.